Hey, it's Steve Brown with Murder and a Manhunt in Entertainment City. After the runaway success of The People vs. OJ, American Crime Story is back for season two. This time, tackling the assassination of Gianni Versace. Shortly before 9 a.m., fashion designer Gianni Versace was shot on the steps of his villa. Buckle up, baby. It's going to be a crazy ride. Suspect on the run in pursuit! Darren Chris leaves his glee days far behind as he reunites with that show's creator, Ryan Murphy, to play a serial killer in the second season of Murphy's acclaimed American Crime Story. In The Assassination of Gianni Versace, Chris is the assassin, the pathological liar, con man, and spree killer, Andrew Kananen. First things first, holy dude unreal in this. Oh, you are <laughs> incredible. I thought it was going to be some something some really profound thought. <laughs> Holy, no, it's got to try the burgers at this. Hotel. No, it's just you in this role as Andrew Kananen is unbelievable. You kill it. Well, I uh, quite literally. quite literally, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that that does happen. You're not better than me. We're the same. The only difference is that you got lucky. Andrew was willing to kill for fame. And and then you see the Kardashians being, their whole empire being built on a sex tape. And then we have a president um, who, who was a reality TV star. If Andrew had been uh, born maybe a decade later, he might have had a reality show. And he might not have had to resort to killing. I'm Andy. So what do you do? I'm a serial killer. You realize the thing people knew is just the murder on the steps in Miami. And so this is about opening up a huge story for people. One of the actors helping to open up that huge story for people is singer Ricky Martin. With the assassination of Gianni Versace going beyond the murder of the fashion designer to tell the story of homophobia in the late 90s, Martin tells me being involved in the project is very personal for him. The fact that it took so much courage for someone as powerful as Gianni Versace to come out, that says a lot about how un you know, the unfortunate times we lived in the 90s. I lived what he was going through. The assassination of Gianni Versace premieres next Wednesday. We'll hear more from Chris, Martin, and the rest of the stars then. By the way, the 2018 Grammy nominees album drops today. Better start listening. You've only got two weeks until the 60th annual Grammy Awards airs right here on City on January 28th. For Entertainment City, I'm Devo Brown.